Hey everyone, I'm Marty, and this is High Risers, Survival Resource Manager. And this is how I subjectively feel about the game. It's because I spend more time managing resources than trying to survive. And it actually makes it my kind of game, you know? I like it. I got the game thanks to the kindness of the developer and publisher, thank you. Before we start, let me show you around. We start at the top of a high rise. Let's meet the crew, shall we? Four survivors, Jess, Ike, Anne, and Mo. Each survivor has inventory space, which can be expanded. They can equip one weapon or one tool. Red bars are their health, and this smaller bar here is called hunger, but I call it calories bar. It makes sense because it doesn't matter if the survivors drink or eat, the bar will be filling up. When the calories bars are empty, then survivors will start losing health and pass out eventually. Every in-game morning, we gain one skill point, which we can invest in one of the survivor's skill tree. One skill point equals level up. What I'm not too happy about is that we are not allowed to level up the survivors unequally. For example, to level up Mo to level 3, first all the other survivors have to be level 2. The buildings have common elements like workbench, like lab table, and I mean laboratory table. Hundreds of things we can dismantle, disassemble, pick up, and use to craft and build and upgrade. And of course, the dreamers. They grow in numbers night after night, and also they are more aggressive at night. In order to survive, we cannot stay in one place, in one building, for too long. Like I said, the dreamers grow in number, night after night, so we need to fuel up our helicopter, fix it if required, pack useful stuff up, and fly away. However, the helicopter cannot fly for too long, at least not for now, so we kinda jump from one skyscraper roof to another in the helicopter. Flying away is not so easy though, survivors need to launch preparation protocol before liftoff, and it takes some time. As soon as we start the engine, a bunch of curious dreamers run up to the roof to, you know, check what's making so much noise, and if we are not ready to stop them or fight them off, then, well, rip the survivors and game over. I'm guessing that the game ends at some point when we have the helicopter fully fixed and upgraded to leave the city for good. That's my guess. We'll see. All right, let's start. I forgot to add that each building is procedurally generated, so we never know what we get. Okay, here we are. First, let's check the helicopter. What we have to do is fuel up. We need, I think, 80 uh, units of fuel to, to fly away. Even though there are exclamation marks here, we don't need to fix anything. Um, it says, HP, uh, that the health of each element is good enough. But of course, we are going to fix what we can to get rid of the penalties you can see here. This penalty is what I want to get rid of the most. So let's see what we have in this building. Tons of boxes. You guys go down. Food here, great. More food. Um, more food. Excellent. And probably more food here. Stop with the with the announcements, um, I, I know what to do. Lab table here, we'll not need that. I saw an axe, fire axe. Yes, let's go get it. Jerry can here, yes, we need that to fuel up the, the helicopter. And oil tank, great. Just get that axe, equip it. Gonna be fighting the dreamers. Where's the jerry can here? Ike, you take care of it. Cogs, yes. Mo, get it. And stay here. Jess, you are going down here to get food and to smash vending machines. More food here and med kit or first aid kit. Wait, wait, wait. 
uh, fire axe here, not here, not here, not here. Oh my goodness, let's go down. No chance to go down here, so whatever. Uh, one axe here, also too many dreamers, so we have only one axe. Let's smash and get more food. Oh, and we have ammonium nitrate fuel oil. This is something we need to craft ammo, shotgun shells, alcohol, useful to craft bandages and cloth fabric also to craft bandages and adhesive I see here. All right, Jess, go down and get that uh, first aid kit. Oh, we have some strawberries here also, great. Do I want to go down here? Yes, first aid kit we have here. Dreamers are, where are you going? Going up? Because I would want to get that food here, more food here, oh my goodness. Yeah, yeah, let's go, let's go. We still have time. So, I see beverage can here. Attack. Attack, damn it. It's auto attack, so we don't do anything. We just sit and watch. And we have one more here. Um, look, he doesn't care. It doesn't care. Okay, we need to give you an medkits and this ANFO and alcohol and shotgun shells and go back here fast to pick up beverage cans and we fight. I'm focused on one survivor now because well the others have nothing to do and yeah it could be nice to have like Oh, more food here. Oh my goodness. Ignore. Ignore it. <gasps> what just happened? Alright, 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 alright. Everyone going up. Jess is chased by two dreamers and she has almost no health. So we gotta run. So if you asked me, uh, how was your day? I see Jerry can here. How was your day today in High Risers? Well, what we have to learn in this game is to recognize items, you know? So I know this is canned food. For example, this is fertilizer, springs, um, and, you know, obvious books, more. They stopped chasing. Okay, okay. Get everyone down here. Attack. And it's freaking uh, too dark now, so. But she can defeat that one. Yeah. Attack this one. Ike, come down here. Quick. Oh, I don't see anything. Help. Apple. Yes, Jerry can. Okay, dreamers are not here, so good. Lights, please. Lights, hello? Yes, okay. We got this. Get more strawberries, Jess. And we'll have to go up fast, get the... Uh, jug, water jug. Mm, you get adhesive and you go up. Strawberries here. Good. You start fueling. I mean, uh, filling up jerry cans. Yes. And this one. Yes. Let's go up and search for useful stuff. 
I see canned food here, and this is what small gas cylinder. Wait, damn it, Ike! I forgot the jerry can. Oh my goodness! Right away. Hurry! What now? Come on. Okay, let's run here, everyone. See, they're running. It's kind of like mini map <laughs> of some sort. So. We ended up searching 26th floor, two dreamers chasing us. We need weapons, we need to craft weapons. They're still chasing, oh my goodness. Wow, we need to use medkit, okay, full health, and just fight them, one of them. One dreamer is down, just fight, and shake that shelf off. Jess, you put, except alcohol, you put all the food on the shelves, yes, and we go down to get more food, oh yeah, Ike, sorry, fuel up the helicopter first, morning, skill point, let's, because like I said, we have to level up like equally, uh, so it doesn't matter which one go first, I would like Jess to eventually have this skill to uh, craft pistol and uh, aluminum to fix the helicopter. Ike, cogs, eventually, so yeah. Anne to produce some food, this skill, I hope. And uh, Mo, you have to be strong and carry more. So Mo first, skill point level one, Jess, Get all the food. Water here, okay. Good to know. Check the fridge. Fuel up. Okay. We go down. Just continue. Smashing. Ike, you need to go down and... Yeah, but we need weapons. I don't see any blades. Like blade... I see... No, adhesive. Damn it! One thing's for sure, we have tons and tons of food. Oh, get this. Uh, screws and wire. We'll need that. Ike. Go down, we'll need more fuel. Ike. Fill up and run and mow. Cogs. No, 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 don't disassemble. I wanted to open it, but it's opened already. What's here? Books and spring. No blades, seriously. I can probably get blades from disassembling something. More food here, my goodness. That's great, actually. We can survive longer. Let's check all the boxes. We got some cool things already, I can see. Mo and Anne, come here. We already have enough fuel, but I want to have more for later. Adhesive here, we'll need that. All right, so we have some water, which is great. Uh, we have gears, you. More fuel, more fuel. You start disassembling ventilation system and Anne, you put uh, medkits here. All the useful stuff we put here for now. We're gonna spend this night disassembling the roof or things that are on the roof. You can see here progress bar of disassembling progress bar. Uh, so I know, you know, when I scroll down, I know uh, what they do and how much longer they need to disassemble things. So it's pretty useful. It's clear here. So Anne, go down one floor below the workbench and start dismantling things here we got aluminum great we'll need that shake it off and keep dismantling okay we have everything disassembled on this floor this floor here there are plants so whatever we skip that and now this floor full of metal shelves we have one freaking dreamer coming up here Pick up all the boxes. My goodness, dreamers are already 
swarming the place. This is not good. Mo, take this one. You take this one. You dismantle this shelf and just this one. This what we have is not enough to build two barricades and upgrade them. But we can start. Jess, leave those boxes on the floor. Mo, continue. Anne, start dismantling this vending machine. Jess, go up here. Mo, continue. I here. Jess, build a barricade here. Okay, this is just a project. And one more here. And I think it's a good moment to save the game. But you cannot just save the game and continue. There's only one option, save and quit. So we're gonna save, quit and continue. Okay, Ike here. Anne here. Dismantle. You search through that crap here. Sheets. And then we're gonna get a lot of things from these vending machines. And it looks like a kitchen. So yeah, from the kitchen. We have more aluminum. Great. Take it. I don't think we can reach oil tank. We cannot. Not anymore. So, but we have enough fuel. So we don't have to worry about that. I just wanted to fill up. Oh, you need food. Oh, I'm so sorry. Uh, Jess, you take care of it. First, pick everything here. Oh my goodness, they're losing health. Oh my goodness, cutlery. And we got blades. Yes, great. I didn't know that, actually. <laughs> well, it's not like I'm expert. I just started to play. But it took me a while to figure things out, you know. Get all the food. You guys keep going. Jess will be here soon to feed you. Eat it. And drink. Okay, they're fed. Now, Jess, get that water back to the dispenser. Okay, go down to the kitchen. Can we? Yes, we can go down and... Okay, Ike, stop it. Run down, quick. We don't have much time, seriously. Jess, craft machete, yes. A blade, pipe and leather. We'll need leather check through that pile of cloth maybe we get some leather here no leather seriously the helicopter should be full yes i could go down and get yeah i will ike i mean ike will go down fast yeah we have some time so go down ike and fill that jerry can up we are so good with fuel i'm so happy Open it up. What's here? What, what is this? Candy. Oh, meat. Oh my goodness. Food and glassware. We don't need that. It's time to manage resources. First, Mo, go down here and pick everything up. Okay, inventory full. So we leave all the stuff we won't need. Oh, crap. Oh, crap. This could be solved differently. Not like pop up all of the sudden, but you know, maybe like you have one skill point invested. We'll need to be able to um, craft cogs. So I unlock basic mechanics. Oh my goodness. It's on the way uh, for now. Rebar, springs, cloth, fabric, screws, pick everything up, get rid of the stuff we don't need. Okay, and now build barricade here. I will need more steel. Ike, put those jerry cans in the helicopter. Jugs two. Mo, I mean Anne, start building the barricade here. We'll need more wood. So Mo is running down. Oh my goodness, dreamers here. I seriously, I have no. Leather. I need leather. Put all the stuff needed to start building this barricade. This one is finished. Open it up. We need to upgrade this 
very keen. The upper one, mesh, rebars and the screws. And first pick up pipe and blade and then craft wire mesh. 15 wires. We have some wires here, I can see. This is terrible for now, you know? I seriously need more wires, more... I need leather. You know, we can have no weapons for now. But we have to have upgraded, at least two upgraded barricades. So put that wire here and start working on it. Leather, maybe. No, go down. There are no dreamers here. We got mesh, wire mesh. So upgrade the barricade. Mo, come on. Leather. Wooden board, cloth fabric. And open, upgrade, what do we need now? Okay, this we have, so we are Gucci. Precious metal, get it, not you. Okay, Mo, upgrade this. And take care of the water. Jess, maybe you should take care of the food. Yes, Jess, go up, or Ike. Okay, Mo, upgraded. Mo. Upgraded more. We need more mesh. Damn it. We still have tons of food, so we don't have to worry. But we have no weapons to uh, cut off uh, lonely dreamers wandering too high. Jess, pass the fire axe to Mo. You know what? I have no choice. I wanted to avoid that, but let's craft that spiked club. And skill point or level up. Yeah, first aid, unlock. Let's do it like this, because one survivor can assist the other and then crafting, building, dismantling is faster. But there can be only one assistant. We also need to craft more bandages, but now it's quite impossible. Okay, get all the stuff here. I help him. Pick up, pick up. Anne, get cloth and get alcohol I, can do that. I left huge pile of cloth oh here oh my goodness yeah I can do that. go down Mo you keep cleaning I found wood and craft bandages as many as you can look how fast it's going when she has an assistance the last bandage, because we are out of alcohol. 24 bandages, great. I bet this desk chair is made of leather. Wow, this spike club is seriously weak. Come on, dismantle, fast. Faster. Yes, I was right. We got two leather, two units of leather. This barricade, this one is whatever. This one is not enough. We need at least six, over 6,000 defense or health points or whatever. The barricade is upgraded, so let's upgrade it even more. Yes, no wire mesh. Good. We have all the materials upgraded fast. It's going to be 3,000 now. Points, defense points. 4,000. Great. Open it up and upgrade again. Yes, cool. Rebars, pipes, we got it all. 5,000 points now. Come on, more. We got it all. Yes? No, we have, we need panels. Metal panels. I left them here. Mo, run down. Seriously, we got like 40 panels here. Okay, upgraded. Can we get some more? We actually, I think I can. Yes, oh my goodness. Awesome. So we need only this barricade. Now we have three weapons. We need four and we need to fix the helicopter. Even though we can start the launch preparation protocol, whatever. Um, let's fix it up a bit. Okay, let's fix landing skids. What we need panels and rebars. Get him. The landing gear is fixed. Fully fueled helicopter. Now, frame. What you need. We have aluminum and uh, 
here would need cogs and rebars. So let's get this first. There are too many, too freaking many. We have to get out of here. And now everyone is level one. So suspended landing gear. Interesting. Our Mo could be stronger. Proficiency in blunt weapons. Yeah, get it. We need your strength. You see, we have our um, helicopter almost fixed. We only need rebars. Here we have some, but it's just one and we need four. Okay, we gotta get out of here. Seriously. Bandages, um, medkit, precious metal. Okay, Ike is ready. Get all the food and drugs and we are ready to go. This will be destroyed in like five seconds. But this is our hope. The dreamers take like three minutes to run up all the way to the roof. Assist, Ike, Jess, yes. Are you ready? Seriously? Yes, I'm sure. Okay, let's do it. Start. They're running. There are around 20, I think. So we have like two, three minutes until they start knocking. We are at like 26% now to launch, lift off, take off, whatever. Let's see, dreamers, where are you? Running 50%. Come on. We're almost here. One, two, and more. I mean, I'm not afraid. We are safe. We are actually more than safe. This barricade is more than enough. Oh my goodness, the sound. My ears. Yeah, like I said, this barricade is done. Still, it took a while. Now this one will be holding long enough. I didn't save. I just realized that I didn't save 75%, let's say. And if the game crashed, and it happens randomly, but yeah. Okay, let's go. Ready? Ready. Uh, no assistance. We can just sit and wait here, but yeah, let's not stall. Go, 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 go. Bye, dreamers. Lift off. So that was the first building sort of introduction to high risers. Like I said, I like the game a lot. I like the visuals. I like the, the retro style. I like resource management. I like the survival aspect. There is also RPG elements. You know, there's tons of things to craft. And the dreamers are cool danger. A little scary, a little sneaky. And I will surely play the game more. But for now, thank you very much for watching. See you in the next episode or in other videos on the channel. Thank you very much for all the subscriptions and thumbs up. And that would be it for now. Bye.